everybody. Um, Welcome back, guys. Yeah, we stayed in this lovely spot for a couple of days, didn't we? Yeah, beautiful spot here. And I think yesterday, all day, we had two boats go by. Yeah, it's been <laughs> so quiet. The day before, it was nine boats. Yeah, and not 50 or 60 boats. No. So it's been yesterday, lovely. it was two boats all day. One one way and one the other. Um, so we've so all Andy's had a real relaxing weekend, haven't you, Andy? Yeah. Last okay. two days. Okay. Yeah, it's Saturday now. Oh. So I mean the last two days he's had a relax. We've all had a relax. Apart from Josh, which has been edited. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a lovely spot. Uh, canal's really quiet, but towpaths really busy. Like yeah, it's hope half is, but that's not too many to worry about. I think we I think actually we're more up there on the way back, wasn't we, Josh? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Let's see. Uh, Dad sat down so he can't even find the picture. Yeah, it's been so quiet. Um, and it's not even the end of some holidays yet. Almost end of some holidays. Couple yeah, of days. got a couple of more days, I think, then everyone I think they'll all be back by Monday to be honest. But yeah, it's just so different compared to, you know, one boat after the other going past, past you, yeah. right, speeding past. They all go at very nice speeds as well, these yeah. people yeah, that we actually see. They all go on tick over. Not one of them has been speeding. No. Well, there's not been many boats to count, but yeah, yeah, they've all gone at a reasonable speed, so good. Uh, I went for a walk uh, down the canal for about a uh, mile and a half, and a mile and a half back. Um, and on the way back I saw this, the sun was setting and I saw this really creepy thing. I looked into the field and then there was just mist, surface mist, on top of the field. This one field. And it's just In the it's evening. really weird, <laughs> ghostly, creeping out. Um, yeah, you usually, get, you usually see it in the morning, but not in the evening. It's weird. Uh, We've got an algae all over the... Canal. Yeah, today woke up and there's algae all over the canal. Uh, I don't know where it came from because it wasn't here yesterday. Uh, yeah, I don't know what it is. It just it looks like little bits of snow. <laughs> Tiny little dots, white dots. Well, uh, Seeds, Dad reckons it might be. Today we're heading to Hours near Port. Doing the final stretch of the Trop Union. Yeah. And once we get past Bridge 1. Three, four. I think we haven't done any more canal than that. Yeah, we've done the whole of the Shropshire. No, I mean, I think that's the part of the canal we haven't done. Oh yeah, there. yeah. We've already done Chester this Zoo, because we year. went to Chester Zoo last year. Yeah. But yeah, join us, are you? The winding girl we turned around in. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. <laughs> Someone towed us all the way down back here, and then we could manage to turn around in here.
this is about as far as we got this time last year. Um, on an Arab holiday. Uh, which you can see the start of on vlog 2. I was meant to be vlogging the whole journey, but unfortunately the cameras let me down and they broke. I said that <laughs> a million times. Yeah, so. Uh, There's something going on. Yeah, it looks there. like there actually is a boat coming. And at an awkward point. Yeah, and you better take over, darling. <laughs> oh, could be more of an awkward point. Slow it point. down, really. But yeah, we, we moored here, went and saw Chester Zoo, and we had to rush back in like two days to get back to. Uh, what's it called again? Anderton. Anderton. Anderton Marina. Oh, um, and we had to go into Blooming Tatin Hall and get pumped out yeah. because they didn't pump it out properly. Um, but there's no winding hole here uh, until quite a bit. I think it might be hours maybe. Oh, give me a second. It's like a sunken, sunken bay or something. Yeah, the next out, the next what? Oh, what am I? Like? <laughs> the next mooring. The next, oh my <laughs> the god! Next winding hole. The next winding hole. <laughs> that hours near port. So, and there's a winding hole just down there. So we had to we we're trying to reverse the boat, but a lovely hey, couple uh, came along, and they actually towed us all the way back to that winding hole. Yeah. Around, didn't we? yeah, we did. I think these are the. This is so quiet. This boat that's passing us now is the one we shared the locks with going down into Chester. Yeah, <laughs> that's the lady just running. You're doing jogging. Oh, I just noticed. Her. I recognised her. She's just doing the jogging this morning. So they've been down Ellesmere Port past us, yeah. not necessarily day before. So they probably stayed the night down there. But this is the only boat we've seen this morning so far. So. Watch out for all the pennywort down there, it gets really bad eventually. Oh, yeah, does it? it like scraping off the power uh, Was Ellesmere Port nice? Yeah, pretty good actually, pretty yes. good. Yeah, make sure you go right down to the basement and put the pennywort down there. Lovely. Oh yeah, we got to know when it's open. The museum. So we go in, it's not open. Last year, this is nothing. Yeah. A few odd bits around at the moment, but we couldn't even move hardly through it last year. I wish we had a video of that, Josh. Really, yeah. see what uh, tell, show you what it was like. Shame, I don't think we even took any photos or videos on our phones or nothing down here either. So I've got nothing to reference back to. No, just the zoo I took a few, but that's, yeah, that's it. that was not very good. We're not going there. Yet. No. I don't know whether it was meant to be a really, really good zoo, but I don't know whether it's because of the COVID after it was shut. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't impressed with it, and it was so... I don't know, it cost a lot to get in. I can't remember how much, but it was a lot of money to get mm. in. 
Oh, not big with zoos anyway. I don't like animals in captivity. No, I like animals wild, free, to roam. Animals in captivity. Yeah, but we're going to enjoy this new stretch now. The last stretch of the Shropshire Union that we haven't done. Yeah. It's almost completed. Can't believe and it. Can, then, and then we can get our plaque. Yeah. Just um, going through bridge uh, 136. The weed is starting to get pretty bad now, isn't it? Yeah, we had to go really straight through it because we couldn't yeah. avoid it. Um, but the bow is really good at pushing the weed either side, so it's alright, it's quite good. Um, Dad used his phone to find out what the plant was actually called, and it was, wasn't it? Well, it was the weed. Called, it yeah, was. Yeah. It's, a good... it's not native. It's not like our pennywort that grows in walls. It's water pennywort. So it was right. from Asia or somewhere. Mm. I'm just looking at this refinery up here. Yeah, we can see. Oh, we've got this up. Full leaves. You can see all the factories on the. Um... This is where they make. There's um, a refinery, Josh. That is where they make petrol and diesel and things like that. Yeah. You can see the flame burning at the top. Yeah, that's the same as. We said Fawley in Southampton got one. It's always lit, isn't it? And yeah, because we're coming. Just burn off the gases that, that produce while making other chemicals. Yeah. We're coming near to Owlsmere Port now, so. Yeah. Starting to see all the industrial side.
don't see anyone for absolute miles and ages <laughs> yeah. on this part of the Trops Union. Um, and then when you do, it's at the worst possible time. Yeah. Like I was... when there's a moored boat on the other side, and it's really narrow and coming through a bridge. Yeah. So I, I, I let, I've been doing the boat, I've been doing Olive, but I let Andy take over then. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, there's a moored boat there. Right next to the sewage work, it stinks. I don't know how they can stay there. Why you want them all there? Bit <laughs> smelly. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. We managed to get through. No one got grounded them up like that. No, so we got. That's only the second boat today. Mm. <laughs> but we actually, had, you know, caught it on there. Actually, the first one was when we got past more boats as well, and the bridge. Yeah. Exactly the same situation. It's typical, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, we're almost down to Alzo Port now. We're at bridge 141. We're nearly and then there. We've got about a mile and a half to it. And then Alzo Port, the north. And then we've got the Union. Yeah, we've done all of it. Bridge and we're in Alzheimer's Airport, Bridge 137. Uh, not the last bridge, hopefully you know, it's all good last bridge. Um, yeah, this is it. We made yeah. it, haven't we? We've made it to the end of the Shropshire Union. Yeah, yeah we've done the whole, oh uh, yeah. We've done the whole, um, the Shropshire Union. Shropshire Union. Yeah,
supposed to work. Urban. Very quiet. <laughs> yeah, it is very quiet. Oh, we've got to move. No, we can't move yet. I've got to pop in and see that he's in lunch at the moment, so I've got to pop in and see a guy in there. Probably about 10 minutes, darling, I'm afraid. It's for boats, isn't it? Yeah, it's for boats, not for fishermen. So, Mum's gone in, haven't you? Yeah, I've gone in, yeah, I've gone in and chatted with the lady in there. She's a really nice girl. Um, it's usually £9.75 each, and that's a whole season for the whole year. They don't do it just for the day, don't know why. But tomorrow, luckily for Taylor's board, tomorrow it's a free admission day. So tomorrow is. And if you do pay the £9 each, you get free moorings for a night. And then it's £4 after that. So I've got to go back and see the lady when our manager comes back. And to ask if we have got to pay £4 tonight. I've got to fill out all this. Sorry. Oh. I fill out all this, these forms, insurance and the number and the, yeah. Do you everything. want to give all that information away to people on the camera? Oh, sorry, well there's nothing really. Your phone number and everything. Oh god, no. I don't know about that. Well, we can cut that out. I've had to fill out a form. I've had to fill out a form to say the number of the boat and address, etc, etc. So yeah, I'm going to go back in a minute and ask if we have to pay the £4 for the night. Because normally it's free for the end, free, for it free if you go into the museum. Yeah, there's so, two locks to go through. A couple of things you've got to think about. I've got to try and turn the boat around there. Yeah. Anyway. That's the thing, that's... Loads are in here. Yeah. Um, also, we weren't going to let the cats out for the that's day. That's okay, it's only one night. I'm only going to stay one night, and Okay. So, and then we'll be off tomorrow. But, you know, it's free tomorrow, guys, so we might as well make the most of it. Josh is going to be busy, but it's busy, it's busy. Josh just wanted to record it really and to see. I think um, I think we've upset a fisherman here because he was fishing here, so he's had to move. So, what's the time? Uh, three, two, half, one.
Yeah. We are going to so we're down here now, guys, and apparently we can't walk because the mirrors are shut off or some shit. But why haven't they told us that? You know? We need to get the centre line, Josh, quick. Get the centre line. That one? Yeah. Follow us along with the centre line, alright? Keeping us against the side. Maybe we could just more up there then. I don't know. Just more up in that middle bit. So we might go back up the locks. So yeah. There's no moorings and the Mersey's shut off. So why... Uh... Have you got it on the, 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 the bit of paper she gave you? Have you got it there with the number? Nope. What a bloody load of good that is. Well, now this is the Taylor's lock for you. There you go. Well, National Waterways Museum. Take a few photographs while we're down here, John. Now we got to go back um, the There's nowhere to moor. I don't know why they didn't tell us this. Can you book a mooring? So we're here in Ellesmere Port now. Um, it's the next morning. I did make an outro last night, but I wasn't supposed to make an outro. I was just <laughs> supposed to make an update. Um, it's the next morning now. Oh, it's absolutely beautiful, yeah. guys. We, um, the last time we saw us, we were trying to get in there but apparently we weren't allowed in there and there was a boy going across stopping you from going down yeah. into that part of the uh, basin for some reason which is weird I don't know why, they didn't tell us no and this where we are now is supposed to be a private mooring but it turns out I don't think it is no, because so someone on the map it shows you red and blue yeah. blue a private, this is blue here and red's over there and red's round there but we can't get round there and the boat we saw yesterday I think stayed here because the lady yeah. opposite said that someone stayed here last night yeah um, yeah, we managed to get here, and uh, we're getting really stressed out, <laughs> especially Dan. And the thing, and the thing is, there's nowhere to put your your pin either. No, it's all hoops, concrete. But with like 15 foot of us are sticking out of the back. Yeah. Um, we are just about holding on, Josh. Well, it looks a bit. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna. Well, last night we went for a nice little walk, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, we Sunset went. Sunset walk up into the museum. Yeah. It was shut, but. For some reason, they let access from the, the dock here, the basin. Yeah, so you can so you see go up there at night that. and have a little look. Yeah. the fan, the air conditioning fan was going all night, yeah, but I, d I had my earplugs in. I didn't hear anything. And there was a wedding there last night as well. Yeah. And they were playing really loud music so quite late. I don't know, I, I was oblivious. oblivious. Yeah, me and me and Josh were oblivious to it. I woke up about six o'clock this morning. I just watched Exiles and I just fall asleep. <laughs> and Andy said, I oh, don't shut any of the windows because it won't bother me. And yeah. then he's come up this morning. Oh god, that was on all night last night. But no. <laughs> there's no lock landing really. The lock, so. Me and Mum are going to walk up. Yeah. Open the lock for Dad so he can just come straight in. 
Yeah. So that's what yeah. we're gonna go and do. We're waiting for him to get up. And, and then we're gonna get to the come top. Out. And apparently the mayor of is gonna be here today, so it's free entry to yeah. the museum. Um, I'm not sure if we're gonna go in or not. We'll see. We'll see how busy it is. Um, yeah, because we've seen we've seen most of it from outside. Yeah. You know? There's a few bits inside I think. There's one side of it we haven't seen because it's gated. Yeah. So we might have a look. Put the rubbish and you go in that way, John. Yeah. See you in a bit. See you in a bit, guys. Then me and Mum thought there was a, we had a bomb in we? Yeah. There was locks on the paddles to release the water into Because it's lock. got a chain. Yeah. But, but what it is, it's just like a little wedge. Yeah, it's the old fashioned. Instead of those little things that go across, the stoppers, like that, it's like a, you have to wedge it in. It's an old fashioned one. They leave it on there to show everybody because it's the oldest way they used to do it. But yeah, we and it was so tight. I've seen it before, so I just thought it was like some sort of locking mechanism. But it was really tight, Josh, yeah. wasn't it? I couldn't even move it. One so. did try, but we thought it was we thought it was a little So a so, nice fan came in out of us. The shop and got ourselves the Shropshire Union back and the Owls we bought back. Because we've done, actually done the whole of the Shropshire Union now. So that's the one canal that we've done. Um, and uh, yeah, we couldn't get out of the lock either because we were too long, weren't we? <laughs> and the day boat was there. Yeah, the day boat was there, so, day boat was there, so they had to move, uh, move back. Do you think you're very happy about? No, he was alright. And then he, he can't he get out there, no. Uh, so I pushed the boat at the front over a little bit and then I managed to get by it, so it was yeah. okay. Oh yeah, we got out of the head. Um, we filled up on water again. Dad had to make the hose a little longer. Double double so I don't know where he is, he's not even on the Double um double hose with a connector. Yeah. But yeah, we didn't go in the museum because it's not our cup of tea, really, is it? Uh, well, we saw most of it last night, to be yeah. honest. It's only in the inside bits. You know, I looked in the windows of the row of houses that they've done up, and they're, they're just like, you know, old fashioned. Yeah. But it gives us something to do next time we come. Um, yeah, we'll yeah, get there. I don't know, I'll give the house report a 5 out of 10. It wasn't that great, but it was all right. Well, it's nice to see the old boats in there, Josh. Isn't it? Yeah. Uh, we're going Smell up. the sea there again. <laughs> yeah, we didn't get over to the estuary. Yeah, we completed the Trotter Union, right? What's that? Yeah. Nice, nice canal. Yeah, back. This part of it, I'm not over keen on. It's too, like, built up. Yeah. But... but the rest of it's lovely. What did you think of the Shropshire Union then, Andy? Yeah, it's a nice canal. That's just two cents. Um, yeah, we're up the locks now, and obviously we're going the same way as we came before, and I've just filmed this, so I'm not going to film it again. No, but we are, we've got to moor up and walk to B&M, because we need some little gas bottles to go in our camping stove. So, that's going to be the end of today's video. Yeah. 
Hope you enjoyed the last Structure Union um, vlog. Well, it's not the last one, there'll be a couple more until we get out of Langrothman. Yeah. But last of the new sections that we're filmed for. Um, gonna make our way through the weed again, head back up. We're not gonna be uh, filming very much, we're gonna do a couple of videos. Uh, probably one video for the channel because I, I need a break from filming. All my SD cards are full up. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna take a break. I've been vlogging non stop for a whole year, really. Um, apart from when I went down Ilfkin for one week and another week. Yes. And that was it, really. But there's so many videos that I need to release, and so many videos are already recorded. All my SD cards and hard drives are filled up. And yeah. So, I'm gonna take a little break so we can catch up. But we're gonna make a vlog as we go through Chester again because we wanna go and have a look yeah. at it. We haven't, even, we haven't seen yeah. Chester yet because we didn't see it last year and we haven't seen it yet this year no. so we're going to go and have a lovely look around Chester. Mm. So we'll show you guys and that. We want to show you that we can go through Northgate Lock because <laughs> it was a bit incontinent. I want to show you we can do it. Ooh, yeah, so we'll try. We'll see you. <laughs> yeah, make sure you su subscribe yeah. and join us, be a Patreon. We have a Patreon, 24 hour early access yeah. and um, exclusive content. And we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.